So yeah, I did my 12 empowerments uh, three years ago here in Goa, in this center. And uh, yeah, it's just beautiful to, to reflect on um, so many changes uh, since then. Um, yeah, and coming here and doing the 12 empowerments for me, it was um, the very first time uh, hearing about my true nature and about, uh, yeah, the true nature of thoughts and emotions. And although I had some background before, I was listening to Balanced View talks a little bit, but then coming here and really go deep into it, um, just, yeah, it's um, awoke something in me um, and made me realize that um, I can't fool myself anymore with um, the stories I was telling to myself. And before I met the training, now I can reflect on that time and it used to be so uh, like, uh, sometimes it felt like I'm, at times I'm, I used to tell myself the story of my life and how it's going, like I used to narrate it in a way, like, uh, and then, <laughs> and then I met, or, <laughs> and then I decided, and it used to be whole, like, yeah, like a story, like a big story and um, lots of drama in it, like every story. <laughs> Yeah, and yeah, and um, I was so much focusing on the way I presented myself to other people, to my friends, and and took so much responsibility to what they might have thought of me, and uh, yeah, what perception they might had about me and um, just used to deal with it so much um, without even noticing but just um, apparently it's a it's a data stream that at some point in my life I just assumed I need to take on and um, yeah just need to make sure all the time that I'm um, presenting exactly what I think I need to be in front of others and yeah, and when, when doing the 12 empowerments and hearing about the nature, the self-releasing uh, of, of everything, um, yeah, so immediately I felt relief from all the belief systems and also I saw um, like a new way that opened up for me and uh, something that yeah, I really took it uh, as something that, okay, I want to go in this way from now on. It was so clear and bright for me. Um, yeah, and maybe I can share a little bit about the changes, like the practical changes I started to see in my life. So, firstly, uh, when being with others, with friends, just like everyday friends and uh, suddenly just starting starting to simply enjoy uh, being with friends and not planning so much how to be or what to say or thinking that if I'm in a certain mood I shouldn't be with others or yeah it all just became so so much more spontaneous like letting myself be spontaneous and trusting that more and more, seeing that, yeah, this is my true nature and the more I got to know it through the support of the Four Mainstays, the more I got to know my true nature just felt, yeah, so much more comfortable with just being with others and of course with my family, um, yeah, just, um, I, yeah, all the time, I think all all of my life we had a love-based relationship in my in my family of origin. But after the twelve empowerments, it just deepened so much, and uh, yeah, just opened up to more love that I just couldn't believe. Like this, yeah, it's 
yeah, keeps opening up. And um, also, um, what I do uh, for work, so I'm a musician and I'm playing the piano and um, yeah, I think that before the training I had so many um, lim limiting data streams about what what it means to be a musician and um, what I take what I've taken myself to be like um, I I had this belief that I'm not like I am a musician but I'm not really a musician. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like I'm not a real musician <laughs> because <laughs> I didn't practice enough when I was a teenager and uh, yeah, so I, I'm like, I'm fooling everyone. <laughs> this is what I felt and this limited me so much in what I, I knew I could do, but yeah, just, um, yeah, I just gave it up because because believing so much in these data streams of I'm not a real musician or whatever. And I started to see after the course that, um, yeah, something opened up there also. And um, I started to enjoy it much more and to even get better at it in a natural way without having even to practice that much, <laughs> just having fun getting back from work and sitting on the piano and play for my own pleasure and I remember that like years before the training a friend of mine told me wow I'm so jealous at you you have this gift of playing and you can just play to yourself when whenever you want and I thought yeah but it doesn't feel like that it doesn't feel like I'm really fulfilling my th like the enjoyment in that like yeah I have this gift but somehow I don't feel like I can really enjoy it and uh, this is something I started to experience after the 12 empowerments just letting all my data streams my these limiting data streams of also learning new things and also letting the data stream of maybe I'm not the best pianist in the world <laughs> 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 letting it be as it is <laughs> And then it it really freed me up to to just to just play and um, I enjoy it so much more right now and also at work um, also needing to impress my colleagues with what I do and uh, yeah with my knowledge also and what I accumulated over the years and being very occupied in showing that and instead of that now there yeah there is just, just also like pure enjoyment enjoyment and focus on uh, just doing what needs to be done and um, get the most out of it in a very effortless way <laughs>